morning, good morning. Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So if you don't know, my name's Alyssa. Today I'm just gonna be doing like a little girls chat type of video, um, talking about my birth control and um, planning on more babies and yeah, just like, kind of like a little life update about birth control, um, things that my experience with it, pros and cons, and if I want more kids. So yeah, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you like this video. Um, I really appreciate it if you guys leave some comments down below. It's very important to me that I figure out what type of videos you guys would like me to post. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into the video. So, um, I want to start off this video just talking about my birth control because, um, so I've had it twice. I've had it once, um, about three years ago when I had my son, I had it in for three years and, um, I had no problems with it my whole time having it. And then I got it again, like two or three days after I had my son. So I've had it in almost two years. My birth control has been hurting like every other day. And um, if you can see, you see the bottom bump is from the first one I had. And the second one right here is from the most recent. And I'll show you guys. See. Damn. You see that like little thing moving in there? Well, that's my birth control. <laughs> and I'm getting it removed today. Wednesday the 21st so I'm pretty nervous and um, my pros and cons about the birth control are for myself it is different for everybody but for me myself personally um, it didn't stop my um, period flow it didn't stop my period at all most people some people it stops some people it makes it heavier for me it just like it was kind of awkward I would have my period like sometimes twice a month, sometimes once a month, sometimes I would skip a month, it would be weird. And I didn't really worry about it this time just because, you know, I have a son to deal, deal with and I don't have time just to be going to, to and from the hospital over birth control. But um, I did end up going to the hospital like last week because it was hurting so bad and I just wanted to see if they would take it out, but they didn't. So I had to schedule this um, appointment at Planet Parenthood and they're gonna take it out today I have um, I have to be leaving here within the next like 45 minutes so um, yeah I'm pretty nervous to get my birth control out but the pros about the birth control are for one hey I didn't get pregnant after three years I'm not having a birth control in my arm that whole time didn't get pregnant haven't got pregnant since I've had it in my arm this time so I guess hey birth control works for the not having the baby's part for me anyway I guess it was like a 99% chance that you can't get pregnant, but I've known somebody, one of my friends actually got pregnant off of this birth control. So I mean, I didn't really gain too much weight from the birth control. I gained weight from having a baby, so I don't blame my birth control for that. Um, it doesn't mess up my appetite. Some people it does that too, but for me it was perfectly fine overall except for the point that I'm starting to get pains in my arm and that's just not okay I feel like it's gonna either broken I feel like it's gonna make me unfertile so I can't have any more kids <laughs> I'm a little over dramatic but hey better safe than sorry that's why I'm getting it taken out excuse my fire um, my fire alarm I need to put new batteries in it <laughs> so um, something else we can talk about is I dyed my hair I don't know if you can really tell but it is lighter um, you can tell in the light, it's way lighter. Mm, I'm still getting used to it, so... Yeah. If you think a lighter brown is cuter on me, let me know in the comments down below. Kids. So talking about kids is... It's, it's known. Everybody should know. If you see my Q&A video, if you know me, if you're my family, you should know. I want more kids. I want to have five babies if not more if I can afford it when I'm older but I um yeah I want five kids so if I got pregnant I would be happy yeah but at the same time if I didn't get pregnant I would be perfectly fine I have my son you know like he's enough for me right now but I do want another baby soon just I don't know how soon I don't know if I'm ready to be pregnant again yet but 
I'm getting my birth control out. Whatever happens, happens. Um, yeah. <sighs> I'm really nervous to get my birth control out today. Um, I hope my lighting is okay. I'm in my bedroom right now. So yeah, I hope that answers that question. If my the baby's question, and I hope um, I, you know, helped some of you guys learn something new about birth control or something. <laughs> But yeah, so this is just like a little girl chat video about kind of what I'm going to be doing, how I feel, and yeah, I don't really know how long this video is going to be, but hey, it's okay. After I get my birth control out, I'm going to be um, showing you, like, tell you about the pain or whatever that happens after I get my birth control, show you guys my little bandage, and then I'll, um, yeah, just let you know how, about the pain. But it doesn't hurt very much. The only thing that should hurt is just the shot to make my arm numb. Because they have to numb my arm before they take it out. And, yeah. Hopefully, they let Richard in the room with baby Richard so he can hold my hand through this process. So, I'll see you guys later. Peace. Hey, everybody. So, it's later in the day. <clears throat> and I just got back from my appointment. It's, um... 4.07 in the afternoon and it's raining outside so when you go in um, you sign in fill out some paperwork and they didn't have any toys inside of the whole entire like waiting room so Richard was just like being obnoxious and <laughs> wouldn't stop crying or throwing a fit because he was tired and wanted to run around and he couldn't do all that because there was like 20 people inside of the waiting room so he was just like really whiny and wanted to leave and so Richard ended up walking up to Burger King with baby Richard and I had to go in the room by myself <laughs> and I was really nervous about that because last time I got my birth control out Richard was right there with me so I was pretty nervous. What they do is um, they ask you a bunch of questions, health questions. And then they um, leave the room and have you swab inside of your V, your badge area. <laughs> you swab in your badge area and check you for any STDs. And you don't get a call back until like a couple days go by. And they only call you back if you have an STD. If you don't get a call back, you're fine. So they did that. And then... Um, the lady left me in the room, and the other lady came in the room, poked my arm, and that is the only part that hurt my arm. It just like, it kind of stings, like it's, just, it's like a tingle, like it, but it's like nothing too major. It's just like, um, what's that? Like the flu shot, you know, the flu shot hurts a little bit, but at the same time, like it's not too bad, it, but it does hurt a little bit. So it does hurt just a tad, but as soon as your arm is numb, they like poke your arm around with like a pin and they ask you if you feel it. I didn't feel it so I said no. And um, then they slice your little um, a little incision, a little slit on your arm where the birth control is. And I'm guessing they just pop it on out. I don't know. They just cut it and slide it out. I don't look. I turn my head while my arm is numb and I'm just like, like this. Just wait and just like, go ahead. And I was making conversation because Richard wasn't in the room with me. So I'm just like, talking to the lady while she's slicing up my arm. <laughs> but yeah, so if you can see, I got my birth control out. And um, they gave me a white bandage. I always ask if they have pink, but they didn't have pink. So I had to um, settle with white, which is fine. Because I only have to leave it on for 24 hours, and or I can take it off before then if I'm comfortable. But I'm not. I'm a little overdramatic. I'll probably leave this on a whole 24 hours. So, yeah. If you guys have any other questions about my birth control or, oh, my old birth control. It's so weird to think I don't have birth control on my arm anymore. Like... I'm so happy it's not gonna hurt my arm every other day like it literally was horrible like I would be in like the middle of like cooking just like if I like stretched my arm out and the lady um also the lady told me that um 
what it probably was was my birth control was like rubbing on like a vein or something so it was making it like sore or just like a little irritated which makes sense but I'm happy it's gone so yeah like I said if you have any questions um, leave them in the comments and yeah I hope you guys like this video about you know my birth control and if I want more babies and yeah so if you guys have any if you guys like this video and leave other video ideas inside of the comments for what you want me to talk about or want me to do just let me know so yeah don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and yeah.